Fire, water, earth, and air are the four essential elements to which life would not be possible without. And today, I'm going to show you how you can capture them, so they can help you balance yourself in the game of life. The main things you will need are empty bottles with cork tops and these LED waterproof lamps in four different colors that you can find on eBay. They will make the elements shine during the darkness. And also an exacto knife and glue. Let's start with Earth, the element of Taurus, Virgo and Capricorn. Decide what kind of bottle you would like to use for Earth and then place moss to the bottom. Fill about one quarter of the bottle. Next, take some other green plants and place it on top of the moss, but don't fill the bottle entirely. You can use artificial plants or small branches you can find outside as well. Now we need to attach the green lamp to the cork. For this step, use your X-Acto knife and cut out a small hole inside the cork. It should be big enough so you can insert the end of the lamp. Secure the lamp to the cork with some glue if you want to, and then you can add it back. To make the lamp less visible, you can attach some fabric or another material around the bottleneck, like that, and then wrap a string around it. With the lamp, the green plants inside the bottle remind me of a forest and the moon shining down on it. To create air, the element of Gemini, Libra and Aquarius, loosen the cotton ball and then place it inside the bottle. After that, take a white LED lamp and put it inside a cotton ball. Make sure that the end is not that visible. Once you have that, add it to the bottle as well. This is how it should look so far. Now go ahead and add more cotton balls inside the bottle and add more white lamps the same way as I showed you before. You can always move the cotton balls around and adjust the placement how you like it. Moving on to water, the element of Cancer, Scorpio and Pisces. Pour in some sand inside a bottle. You want to create a thin layer of sand. After that, you can add small stones or shells to the bottom. Once you're done with that, add water inside a bottle. And to make everything look more mysterious, add a blue colored lamp inside the cork and close the bottle. This is how it looks in the dark. Now you can also cover up the bottleneck with some string so the lamp is not visible. And the water element is finished. To capture fire, the element of Aries, Leo and Sagittarius I'm going to use yellow, orange and red colored magic pearls that grow once they are in water. First, I added a little bit of yellow pearls inside the bottle and added a little bit of water. Once they got bigger, I repeated the step with orange and red magic pearls. You want to add as many pearls so the bottle is almost completely full. Once you have prepared the inside, empty the bottle a little bit so you only have one part filled with pearls. And now we can add the red colored lamps inside. For this step, I placed one lamp inside and then added more magic pearls on top. And then added another lamp. You want to cover the lamps with a thin layer of these pearls. Use a stick or something else to move around the lamps if necessary. Make sure that the lamp is not visible once it's inside the bottle. And if you want, you can also add one of the lamps inside the cork so it shines down the bottle. And you're done. So what is your element? I hope you enjoyed this DIY and found it helpful. If you did, be sure to like this video and to subscribe if you haven't already so you don't miss any of my other videos in the future. Have a wonderful day everyone and see you next week.